Amelia, mi amor, I do remember the Gothic Quarter in Barcelona. The arches. I don't know if I ever told you, my first kill after my embrace was in the Gothic Quarter in Barcelona. The next day, a feeling of dread washed over me and I went back to the place I had been the night before. The rain had washed it all away and my spirits were uplifted. Oh, the arches. They are so beautiful. I must see you. Please meet me in Paris in October. It has been too long since I was able to gaze into your eyes and see the eternity of promise that lay before us when you hold me with your gaze. Knowing you to be so close creates a powerful beckoning with me, and I cannot resist it. We've shared so much, I find myself imagining you in ways that transcend my surroundings. I find that I am a psychological chameleon as of late. More and more, I bond to the kindred around me, so much so that I lose what it is to be me. A month ago, I awoke to find that I had been portraying one of my victims. On the night that I held him powerless in my embrace, I wanted to study his life through his own perspective. Have you heard the phrase, my life passed before my eyes? I actually experienced this, his life, as I drank my fill. This particular canine was of the black hand. I hold glimpses of his memories, enough to say definitively, you have it all backwards. The Sabbat is a crazy religious mob full of fanatics and overwhelming emotion and righteous indignation. Confident that they are both saving the world and damning themselves in the process. But there is an eye in this hurricane. Hidden at its heart is a calm so disciplined that their existence is devoted only to serve. Hidden at the heart is a lethality so deadly that despite their best efforts, they have become celebrities to the Sabbat. Hidden within the eye of the hurricane is the hand that directs the storm. The spot is used by the black hand in a few unexpected and very effective ways. First, the Sabbat acts as a camouflage to conceal their efforts and presence. Howling fanatics make for an extremely convincing distraction. Second, the Sabbat is a proving ground for potential recruits. As you know, the Sabbat will use mass embrace as a means of increasing their numbers in a siege of a Camarilla city. Occasionally, a, a very few of these shovel heads, as the Sabbat refer to them, will survive to be recruited by packs that may have lost some of their members. This trial by fire recruitment method works very well for the Black Hand because they direct Sabbat packs into dangerous targets as a distraction. Those Sabbat who prove themselves lethal and level headed will be screened to see if they are capable of discipline and loyalty to the Hand. The Sabbat is a fundamentally different organization in a few very important ways. First, they are a collection of different organizations under one name, in addition to the various political factions such as the Pander Movement, Ultra Conservatives and the Loyalists, there are various groups with their own not so hidden agendas. The two parent clans, La Sombra and Zemis, have their own rich histories that are as old and distinguished as any in the Camarilla. Asamites still loyal to the Sabbat, joined not because they believe in the religious cause of freedom, but because they are being persecuted from either the Tremere or from the ancient vampire that has risen in Alamut. The Harbingers seek revenge against the Giovanni and know the Sabbat clashes with them from time to time. But it is the Black Hand that seems to be most integrated into Sabbat society and yet absolutely stands apart. The Black Hand is the only group that can break the laws. It is written directly into the Sabbat's Code of Milan. All must support the Black Hand. Imagine if there was a seventh tradition that said all must support, I don't know, pick a clan, Bruja, let's say. All must support the Bruja. The prince would say, young Bruja, you have broken the masquerade and put all canines at risk. And the young Bruja would say, oh, eldest among us, I invoke the seventh tradition that all must support the Bruja. It would be anarchy. But this doesn't happen as often as you might think. There's a ruling council for the Black Hand known as the Seraphim. These monsters enforce their will with assassinations and martial force that curbs the enthusiasm of even the craziest zealot. If you've ever wondered why some Sabbat Crusades go off with a bang and others with a whimper, you need only look for answers no further than the Seraphim. If the Black Hand wants to eliminate a particularly effective Camarilla prince, 
They get the cardinals to whip the Sabbat into a frenzy. And before you know it, the Sword of Cain is off on a crusade. The crusade might fail spectacularly, but not before a group of Black Hand slip into the city in the middle of the confusion. The Black Hand are experts at assassination and are very, very good at making it seem as though it was Camarilla treachery all along. They might leave the Seneschal's blood at the scene where someone can find it during the investigation, for example. Black Hand command structure is very small. The five Seraphim represent a command council that hands out orders to the Dominions. The Dominions organize the efforts to carry out those orders, and that's it. Every member of the Hand is one step away from the highest level of bosses. The Black Hand pivots very quickly to respond to threats. However, this also means that the selection process for the Black Hand is very difficult. The Dominions assign Black Hand to roles such as Watch Commander and Census Taker. This provides a knowledgeable boots on the ground asset who can help answer questions about threats in the area from inside and outside the Sabbat, as well as keeping tabs on how many packs are local and which of them shall promise as recruits. When the numerous interests of the Sabbat have proven themselves too fractious, too divided to keep the sect whole, a civil war ensues. The Sabbat have had many. Each and every time the Sabbat has been divided, it was returned to peace by the Black Hand. At least once, the Civil War was concluded because the Black Hand killed all of the leadership on one side of the conflict. All of them. It's clear the Black Hand is playing the great game towards a goal that doesn't align with Sabbat sect goals. I am certain my ruse was discovered, and they know I am not one of their own. The Black Hand is resourceful and may yet track me. The temporary loss of my identity hidden in the life of my victim is a frightening experience that I fear may again consume me. You are my guiding light, the memory of whom keeps me anchored to my identity. Know that as I look upon the faces under the eternal moonlight, it is yours that I see. Until Paris. Eric Berlin, May 1936.